my channel hope you're all having a lovely day today's video is going to be a candle review from a candle i picked up in audi um this is um, one of their festive candles and it is in the scent christmas rum punch um this is a tin candle has one wick i don't know how much is actually in there because i cannot see a weight on the actual side of the candle anywhere so it doesn't actually give you a no from what i can see it doesn't give you a you know doesn't give you any weights or anything like that but it is a tin candle from Audi one wick and yeah let's just get into the review first of all I do actually quite like even though it's a tin candle which I'm not overly keen on but I quite like how this looks nice and festive so great for the festive period you get the label on the lid as well there and I believe this was under three pounds <coughs> excuse me in my local Audi store now the actual scent on cold sniff is super super strong it's a creamy kind of you get undertone of bakery in there but they get the gorgeous warm rum winey punchy kind of smell absolutely gorgeous perfect for christmas now when i burnt this when i first burn was really good i was really impressed i actually got a super strong throw and i was like filled my whole living space but oh this is fantastic and um the only thing is I did have to put tin foil around it a couple of times just to get the wax pool going but I did have a few issues with it which I thought I would do to be honest with you. I thought it was too good to be true. I didn't get an even burn inside the tin. There's a lot of wax that was left around the sides. It's almost and um, here you go you can see it here and the reason there's a little bit of a dip in the bottom I burnt it a little bit this morning so I didn't actually give enough time to pull out but anyways you can see what I mean by some of the wax that was left around the sides not a huge deal though to be honest with you the majority of it did pull out there was wax for most of it but just a few bits didn't um but I'd say well, after I got about a third of the way down the scent did diminish but for three quid or whatever I didn't really expect too much and it delivered how I thought it would do in some ways slightly better than I thought it would do there was no sooting or anything like that coming off um and I'd use this again I would buy it again as maybe a buffer candle because I did still get a scent throw from it but in the beginning super strong scent throw but after i burnt it a few times it went to more of a light to medium scent throw i'd say i recommend this to be better in a smaller room maybe but um because my living space is quite large but it wasn't a terrible candle it just wasn't great either would i recommend anyone buying this i think to use as buffer a buffer candle yes but if you're expecting to get a huge scent throw from this you may be you know surprise in the beginning but as you burn down it you're gonna the scent throat is gonna you know become less and less and become you know lighter and lighter so as a buffer candle fine but you know don't expect too much from it so there you go there's my review i do hope you enjoyed the video and found it useful please subscribe if you're new please let me know if you've tried this candle and how you got on with it and i'd love to hear from you i hope you have a lovely day bye